Hi everyone, this is a short video tutorial on the SAP Cloud for Customer login process or C4C login process. This assumes that you have already installed the C4C app in your iPad. So this is the initial uh, setup. Once you tap the C4C app, it will launch it and initially will be presented with the creation of the passcode. So Remember, uh, passcode, don't be confused between your passcode and your password. Passcode is just the, is, is like a pin code in your C4C app uh, for you to protect uh, the application so no one else can use it. So, in, creation, uh, in creating the uh, C4C passcode, uh, you must remember that it has to be 8 characters. It should have 1 uppercase letter and 1 lowercase letter and one number so in my case um, uh, for example let's create a passcode rep chem at one two three rep chem at one two three so let's continue just wait for it to complete uh, if it does not proceed just press again the continue button Okay, now you will be presented with a server setup screen. This is done just one time. So after you set it up, it will not be the same screen. Now uh, we type in the server address which is my327529.2.2. So notice that upon typing C, uh, it already suggested to you the complete server address, so you just stop it. Now remember that um, SAP C4C has a lot of other uh, clients. They may have another server name, so make sure that you type in the correct server address because once you don't, you won't be able to log in. Now you set it up again just to continue. Uh, you type in your assigned username and password. So in my case, this is my username. And this is my password for the purpose of this tutorial. So, you might ask, do you want to tap the remember password? Well, uh, it depends on you uh, because um, tapping the remember password provides some convenience uh, once you launch ne next time the C4C app. Because uh, once you type in just the passcode, you will already proceed with the C4C app to the main page. But uh, um, I encountered some problems with you doing uh, remember password because over time once you decided to reset your password because you might have forgotten it, uh, some of you are having problems doing this uh, login again because you have to recreate the whole thing, the setup. So I suggest that uh, you do not tap the remember password. It would be a good habit just to type your uh, password, C4C password every time. So now, let's proceed. Uh, I log on. Okay, so notice now that I have successfully logged in to my C4C application. That concludes the initial setup of C4C. Uh, I want to show you, perhaps when, you, when we log off and try to launch it again, so you will notice now the difference the next time. Okay, so it's closed. So now, uh, the next login, you should just type in your passcode. So this is the passcode. When I tap log on, she would see it. it's asking me, it has saved my uh, server name and my user ID. Now I just type in my password. So login. Okay, so that completes the login process in C4C app. Thank you.